this last kicker. The following contest is an extreme rules match. Making her way to the ring from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. Go ahead, Byron. Get head over heels. Tell us all why Becky Lynch is so great. A young lady who has prided herself on being different. A young lady who has prided herself on thinking outside the box. And she has taken that mentality to tremendous success here in WWE. Becky Lynch should be prosecuted for improper use of the metal horns out here dressed like something out of an H.G. Wells novel. Women with Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Wow, has Charlotte evolved from those times? The baddest woman on the planet. It absolutely amazes me how quickly Ronda Rousey and seamlessly made her transition from the world of mixed martial arts to WWE. She improves each and every time she steps in the ring. A real natural. And from Venice Beach, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. to get their thoughts on a triple threat match like this. Looking a little dazed here. Yeah, she's definitely not looking at herself right now, Cole. Inside the ring now. In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly which superstars have what it takes to truly get extreme. point about superstars having what it takes to get extreme. I would argue that every superstar in the locker room possesses a mean streak. Yeah, but not all mean streaks are created equal, Michael. But I'd say there's only a select few who can turn their mean streaks all the way up to the most extreme level. Ooh, nice Russian leg sweep. Shot in the back, softening them up. Oh, this, this could be dangerous. This could hurt. Suplex. Unreal. 
Ronda Rousey got out of there in time. Beautiful technique. And it's Charlotte with the reversal. There's a reason why she's genetically superior. Real quick reminder, guys. There are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. What a strike. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. She reverses out of it, and not a second too soon. Close call there. Got it. Michael, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years. And perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. Oh, and a knee, and another... Just endless knee strikes. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Ring of the eye. Oh, that's not right. Somebody do something about that. She's certainly looking good now, Cole. Boom! <laughs> nice. Shut it down. Charlotte is in trouble. Sometimes you'll see a smile on Ronda Rousey's face, but that changes once she goes into combat mode, Corey. Call the cops when Ronda's on the loose. She'll tell you she's not a wrestler or a fighter. Ronda's a martial artist. Her judo training means she puts out maximum efficiency with minimum effort. There's a philosophy, purpose, and direction in everything she does. We're going to have a hard time stopping Becky when she's doing this. Nailed it. Byron, Corey described Ronda's judo philosophy and with her extensive combat background, how does her past translate to competition in WWE? Well, Rousey is learning that her skills can make her a dominant force in WWE, but she still needs to remember that there are moves she's never felt in an octagon and rules that make those moves perfectly legal as well. Down goes the referee. There was just no getting out of the way on that one. At 2016's Clash of Champions, it was another classic triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship. It was Bailey versus the boss, Sasha Banks, versus the champion, Charlotte Flair. The match started out more like a singles match between the boss and the queen. Bailey learned very quickly. She's looking at it, looking to full way back. That's just Charlotte proving her dominance. She's locked and loaded and taking no prisoners. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. This might be it! Oh my! Look at her go! Ronda Rousey got out of there in time! Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here! Does Becky Lynch even know where she is? Oh, this is not good at all. The focused attack on the back. Look at this. Yeah, I love the effort here, but she better hope she can sustain it. Oh, gut punch. Nasty. We'll see how long she can keep it up. Charlotte, big move. I'm going to be careful not to get disqualified. What a comeback. This is Charlotte's best chance. The Queen has to capitalize. Reversal by Becky Lynch. Exploder suplex. Ray 
Omega the out. Oh, that's not right. Somebody do something about that. Warm up the bus. This one is over. She's got something in mind. She might have it. Oh, that's Shut not right. Somebody do something about that. Man. Man. We might be looking at a victory for Becky here. Oh, man, she's rolling now. Is it enough to put Becky away? And the triple threat is over. This place is going nuts. Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. Critics of these ladies in the WWE might not have been very impressed, but they did do some nice things in there. Who could forget this? Nobody can say he didn't earn this win here. Really a solid, bordering on great performance. Here is your winner, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Talk about having to dig down deep to pick up the win. Simply put, she wanted it more than the other two did tonight. And it's matches like this one that makes SmackDown.